Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I wanted to be showcasing a little resource pack I've been working on recently and it's called Vanilla Shaders. Now this is kind of vanilla shaders and I'll show you it's so simple to install you literally pop it in your resource packs folder and boom you just literally drag it over and there you go now you have enabled your vanilla shaders now the only requirement now yes I do say it's vanilla shaders but you actually do need one or two mods and that one mod is Optifine which then again you, if you're using 1.8 chances are you are using vanilla shade oh sorry you are going to be using Optifine because of just the sheer amount of lag that some people get on 1.8 but if you don't want that then you just need to install MC patcher which is equally really really simple but the reason I put vanilla shaders there is just because of it not having to use the shaders mod and it gives really nice results as you can see without actually using the um, without using much like resources such as the um, the normal shaders mod also with the shaders mod your graphics card might not support it or might not definitely give good FPS because of uh, Java's engine and it might not make it run very well but as you can see here it looks really nice as you, I'm gonna just turn off vanilla shaders and uh, I'm gonna turn it and you guys are just gonna be able to see the awesomeness there we go this is vanilla and you can see the water's deeper and bluer and oh no definitely don't open it to land and there we go this is going to be vanilla shaders now I'm going to show you guys a literal not side by side but I'm going to literally sort of layer over the vanilla shaders to the normal vanilla minecraft so you're probably seeing that now and yeah you guys should be able to see a massive difference hopefully you know you can see that the sky looks nice the sun is amazing and uh, the water's cool but I've also changed around some of the color maps now with the color maps I'm going to grab a quick torch here and the color maps basically make the shadows d darker and deeper as you can see here they are a lot deeper and darker but the o now I've also turned my brightness down to about 30 and that's how you get the best sort of results you can put it down to zero and Actually, I kind of like that as well. But yeah, you will need to turn your brightness down um, depending on, you know, what you're playing. If you're playing like a mini game, then it might be quite dark. So you might want to just pop it back up a bit. Now, the only files this edits is just the color map file. So, you know, you don't actually, uh, you can literally overlay a texture pack on. And look, this is the torch texture. As you can see, you can see there's a slight bit of flickering. And I think that's also with color maps, but it looks quite cool with the torch I think it looks really nice um, but yeah as you can see I really like how it gives you some oh yeah look at that underwater oh nice but yeah as you can see this is a really nice little pack here and you can overlay any single texture pack to say if I wanted faithful or if whatever I can literally go into my resource packs folder put that in make sure this is above that so there's usually a little arrow here that shows uh, above and if you have that, then the shaders should work, and it'll look really, really nice, hopefully. And, uh, yeah, I, I've, honestly, I found out about this using Optifine recently, and I found out that you can put these, like, colour maps in. And I've been testing around, and I tried to get the nicest textures, and now... And I managed to do it. I managed to make this thing look really nice. I mean, here's a perfect screenshot. I mean, uh, that would definitely be a thumbnail for a video of some sorts for me because that's brilliant and I really like it because I get really nice FPS with it I'm currently definitely over 60 I mean currently action basically caps my FPS to 60 but I'm over 60 because I, it says it in the bottom and um, it, there's no lag it's just looking amazing and yeah you guys can literally install it it's so simple to install drag it into your resource packs folder and make sure you have Optifine or MC Patcher I think even Forge, I think if you just have Forge installed, it might do this as well. But again, I'm not too sure. But anyway, guys, I did tease this to you. So hopefully you guys like this and hopefully you're going to be using this a lot. And if there's any bugs or anything, please notify me because I definitely want to fix them as soon as possible. Anyway, guys, I will see you next episode. And I thought we could all hold hands at the end and look at the sunset go down with the vanilla shaders. Amazing. Anyway, guys, I will see you next episode. Peace out.